direct my dad to my doctors. I need to do is keep going straight over and see where and then I want you to turn right down there. Yeah, I'm taking right turn here. So. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, uh, hang on. We are go. Straight Down there. On. Straight on. Straight on, no. You can turn right. Not there, like just Look, see, we can't take no right turn here, yes. Only left turn. We are go. I'm going to the I'm going down there. Then may I may ask you about straight on. And this right now. Yeah, this right, that's what I meant. Oh man. That's what I said. I said turn right here. Yes, sir. No, keep going straight. You can park anywhere here if you want to park there. There's no double yellow line, so. Back in a minute. For private and confidential reasons only, I didn't record in the consultation room when I got my shot done. So, sorry about that, but enjoy the next clip. Okay, Bye. so I'm back again now, YouTube family, and I'm back from the doctors. Um, couldn't really bring my phone, weren't really allowed to bring my phone into the, surge, into the consulting room to video <laughs> my shot. Anyway, so I can, what I can do is tell you what happened. Um, first, I'm going to tell you um, about stuff about my dad and stuff like that. Uh, just to go into it a little bit briefly. I'm not going to go into too much. Right now, I'm kind of pissed off with my dad. But anyway, we're well, not pissed off, I'm just annoyed at him. But I'll go into another video, like, properly. But anyway, I'll tell you that, obviously... You know, as you've seen, the last clip is, um, you know, like, directing my dad to my doctor's surgery. Because um, it's now where my doctor's surgery is, so kind of directed him. And um, we got there, and, like, he didn't even, like... Like, I was half expecting him to park up, come out of his car, and come with me into the doctor's surgery. Wait for me to be seen, till I got seen. And, like you know, come and come into the consulting room with me, but he didn't, and I was walking back to, like, come on, come, Are you, you're not going to come, like, I was, and I was like, you know what, forget it, like, second attempt to try and get him to convince him to come out of the car and literally come and support me properly, but never, I'm not complaining, because at least he'd take me to my, you know, appointment, and he, uh, pick, and he dropped me back home so can't really complain 
Okay, so uh, I'll go into that story about that, like, obviously, uh, another video. Um, but basically, I got my shot. My second shot. Then. Hey! So obviously, I went into doctor's surgery and I waited. I think it was about like a ten minute wait, and then like um, went in and uh, you know like. What I am like lolling at is the fact that they literally have no idea, no clue about prescribing testosterone to trans patients. They they really have no clue about trans stuff. They really have no clue about the whole thing. They have no clue. I had to tell the doctor this is this, I'm supposed to get this done, I'm supposed to have, you know, um, and like, he was just, at times, he just kept talking over me and stuff, I was like, you can talk, but can you wait to finish talking, because you don't know the procedure for treating me to Sasha, I had to tell him that I need I need um, regular blood tests to check my hormone levels. Yeah, I had to tell him that. And I had to tell him that my endocrinologist, when I went to um, my first um, endocrinologist appointment, which was 21st of December, I went there uh, to Harrogate and they, my endocrinologist doctor told me that with Sustanon, I should get self-administered. They should train me, they show, show me how to, to, to use it, um, and then I should get self-administered. But obviously, with my first shot, I'm not, I, I, I actually shouldn't expect and i didn't expect for them to give me sh straight away shot so um, my doctor said look all right um because i said to him i need i need self administer i need to self administer these but that's what i mean and the canonologist doctor said i need to self administer so obviously he said look i will show you how to do them on your next shot and then the shot after we can get you to self administer um because he wants me to, he wants to do a couple more shots on me first before, uh, to see if i'm confident enough to do it um and he, he did show me i did watch him do the shots and um, watch him well prepare prepare the testosterone and like my goodness bah girl let me tell you something this the vial is freaking tiny, like, like, it's like that size, the vial, the vial is that size, and the needle is literally, that's, that's, that, that length, and the needle, the thickness of the needle is very, very thin, very, very thin, the syringe is like, that long and that thick so it ain't even it's tiny everything was tiny i like well i i i, I do understand i i can't accept this because my hands are tiny <laughs> so if i was to self admit and do this myself i'd be like <laughs> you get me it's tiny but it said couple more shots and I'll get you to do it yourself, you get me, like, uh, and then, obviously, I'd have to, he'll probably get me to sh to do it myself in front of him, and then, obviously, when, and then, obviously, he get me to, it, 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 like, I'd have to ask him, like, obviously, I try to ask him, obviously, when I do, the day that you do get me to do it myself, how, like, do I have to come into the surgery? 
because I don't even, I shouldn't even need to come into the surgery to do South Administer. I should go home and South Administer. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, I should be able to do it at home. Um, and if so, if you let me do it at home, how then do I get my testosterone prescription? How do I get my prescription? How, where do I get the needles from? Where do I get the syringes from? Where do I get the, do I, do I need like a, 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 um, what do you call it, um, do I need a safety, a needle, a needle disposal container and the alcohol swabs and stuff like that, all of that to prepare and do my shots, like, he didn't even let me answer the, ask the question, he kept interrupting and saying, well, you need da 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 da, and you know. Now, my doctor was saying that the testosterone, I hope you do know about this can cause, can, this can cause uh, testi uh, uh, te te uh, testicular cancer, and your men and stuff. But I ain't got no, t I ain't got that down there at the moment. So what do you mean? Anyway, so he did my, I, I watched him do my, uh, prepare the, um, the, the syringe, the ejections and stuff like that. Got on the bed, you know, dropped the pants. Turned on to my right side and he done it on my left. Because he done it on my right first, which is my first shot, which was four weeks ago. And then on my left. So I was expecting to my left side to after he done the shot he put the inject take the injection out the needle out my thigh I was expecting it to hurt like hell I was expecting it I was expecting to be limping from the consulting room to my dad's car was I fuck I'm limping because a little tiny bit because right there where the where he put the injections it does feel a little bit uncomfortable and it does feel like it does feel a little tiny bit numb but apart from that it fine there's no pain actual pain like my first shot there's no pain so it, it, it's it i'm not even in pain right now like literally i'm not even in pain any pain at all it's just this slight discomfort in my in my in my in my leg there um I actually expected it to be worse than I thought, and it weren't. It's fine. Do you know what I mean? So, like, things cool. So I walked from, I, I, you know, I, they give me like a form for the blood test, and the blood test that I have to get. So obviously, uh, my blood test is. Yeah, give me a form for it. So my blood test is right up here. That's the time for my blood test. And that's the date. So, I had to hand that into reception. And um, they booked me an appointment for my blood test. Um, and on my way. And then goes into my dad's back into my dad's car and my dad has a fucking he he asked me like I hate when he asks me questions like if he avoided asking me questions about it he would have avoided and it would have there wouldn't have been any argument okay so basically me and my dad had this my dad asked me some questions about my appointment uh, that I just had my injection that I just had and like um me and my dad had a little bit of disagreement coming out the lane now he started driving really fast like faster than like the speed went whoosh. but anyway i'll go into that like another you know video but got my second shot ladies and gentlemen and i'm feeling good i'm feeling good and now i'm going to cut this video short i'm going to get myself some make myself something to eat because man like brooklyn hungry anyway so that's me mr tran tran pan man uh, this is brooklyn 
and I'm going to see you next time. Peace.